Please check out our shirt on Teespring. Hey folks, what's going on? Little bit, a little curious, not too nosy. I'm going to talk about this uh, movie. Kind of mix of a tutorial teen drama, six comedy. It's called Bottoms. It came out in 2023. And the director of this movie is Emma Sutherman. So pretty much, it takes place in a high school. You got these two lesbian teens, and this is like their final year, but they know the bottoms, well, they have to figure somehow to get lucky with these two other cheaters to have crush on. And so both of them went to some fair before the high school year started, and they found out that there was a rumor going around about them, how they both went to juvenile hall. First day of school, the first class, there was an announcement that one of the girls was duty a but like really attacked by the football team from the other high school attack. So after that announcement, the, most of the girls in the class are freaking out. I don't want to be next. I'm in danger. Um, I fear now of the other football team basically the same thing to me. So somehow they got the principal to agree to this uh, surviving class for girls to learn to fight and defend themselves from the other football team's high school. But the main goal is to get lucky with the two cheaters to have a crush on. So well, that gives you an idea what the movie is about. Honestly, it feels like they took a bunch of 80s movie, pumped it with steroids, and put a lot of ways that what teenagers are going through and made into a movie. It's this really silly, outrageous thing. It's like one reason it was going to be really silly is uh, the football players are always wearing their uniforms with the uh, gear on, in the cleats and the pads. It's all you see him wearing the whole entire movie. And also, you don't see too many people playing adults in this thing. Um, you got, the, like, the, in, in the school, you have the one cheater that they talk to and the person bowls. That's very much at the school. And you see one of the girls' is, uh, mothers, and that's very much you see in the adult. Also, we watch it. Uh, watch the background, the football players, because they're always doing weird stuff. It's kind of hilarious. I had to watch it, rewind a couple of times to see it. It was really kind of funny. So the movie's only like 93 minutes long, but it's very, uh, you know what's going to happen next. That's very much, but, you're, but you don't know what they're going to say next. That was making Mark Tree about this movie. It's really raunchy movie, really sexual. But I'm sorry, boys and girls, no nudity, no nudity or sex. I'm sorry. Maybe next time, maybe in the sequel. But this is a very durable movie. The pacing was great, the humor of it, you know, there's a lot of heart. That's the reason it kind of reminds me of the 80s movie. I mean, it could be as pickable as possible, but as long as you put some heart in it, you put some likable characters, I mean, the movie would be great. Also, this is like a strange version of 80s movie set on today's, uh, you know, when kids talk today, maybe. I'm not kidding no more. So let me know, like, and subscribe, maybe do a better next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>